Saz and Julian here at Paddle Smash Academy, and today we're doing a, a review of Will Paddle's Pearl, Bea Gonzalez's racket. I mean, it's a beautiful racket. Yes. Right? I mean, it's got beautiful colors, white, uh, a little bit of, I don't know what this color is, but blue, dark blue, and a little bit of the green. I think it looks like a beautiful racket. They did a great job of designing it. What do you think? I mean, honestly, uh, the technology behind Bull Paddle, uh, it's outstanding. They really, they, look, they're a paddle company, so they know exactly what they do. This is more like a diamond shape. You will feel the, the weight right here. Uh, because it's designed for a, a professional female player. It's a little bit lighter from my personal view, but honestly, it was a really, really good racket, honestly. Uh, I don't know, what do you think? Uh, it's got 12K uh, carbon, I mean, multi-EVA. Um, I thought this was a great racket. Yeah. You know, I know. I, I, I say it on your face when you were hitting yeah, it. I mean, yeah. You know, <laughs> I love Bea Gonzalez anyways. You know, she designed a great racket with bull paddle. And they make cream racks. Like you said, yeah. that's what they do is this paddle. You know, they don't do anything else but that. Well, one of the things for, for you guys to know, it, it's when you see the name of a professional pl uh, paddle player stamping on that racket, the paddle player had almost 100% saying of what they want on that racket from the way, the composition, the EVA, the carbon, the grip, what type of grip and all that. Pretty much the character of the racket. Yes. It's pretty, it's pretty much what the, the professional player is looking for and how they play. Yeah. Uh, and this was just a lot because, you know, these companies create, you know, they spend a lot of money in R&D, but when they're working with a professional player, it, that takes it to the next level. Yes, com completely. I mean, they go meeting after meeting testing and testing and testing with that player until they come out to the perfect racket for that specific player. Uh, obviously, this is more oriented to a, a female female side, even though he loved the racket. Uh, <laughs> it's, but, too, it's too much for you, though, right? Well, but I think it's 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 more about the pearly. You know, he's, he likes more the bling bling and the pearly style uh, rackets. <laughs> and, and I got to say something, too. You know, usually it takes a few years. Like, she just got, got signed on with a bull paddle. Yeah. Right? So it usually takes a few years to develop that. The perfect racket, but man, right out of the bat, man, I yeah. think this thing is yeah. freaking amazing. Uh, what did you like about it? What did you not like about it? The let's talk about the cons. I mean, for me, me personally, it's a little bit too light. Uh, but I, it's I, I didn't feel the racket. I, I didn't feel the racket on my hand when when I hit the ball. It's uh, that, but it's that me. It's it's my my personal feeling. Uh, but the, the 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 overall feeling it was pretty good. Uh, but it, it, it's still too light for me. I need to something who can generate more power on my shots because I got to put so much body weight behind that shot or much, too much muscle. Now, um, you know, I, I want for the racket, for my way of playing, the racket to work with me, no, no against me. So this racket, I need to put some, some behind it. So uh, the pros, uh, beautiful look. The design is great. The R&D behind this is great. But it's just, uh, it's too way there. You know, it's too, too, the, the weight is not there for me. And the, the, the um, I, it's something missing. You know, I can't really tell you what it is, but it's, it's a little bit too soft for me. How, how about you? Um, for you, it's your, your. I got to disagree, man. That, this <laughs> thing feels really great, man. Um, it's going in the top five of my best rackets when it comes to female rackets. Wow. Sure. I mean, I feel like the ball came out very, it came out very quickly, you know, and had very good control of, of, of this of this racket. Um, I, I mean, I would, I think this is a great racket. Um, so I, I, in that respect, is good. Yeah, it's a little bit lighter. Um, it, you know, it could use a little more, bit more oomph, but I mean, I think with less effort, the ball comes out faster and, and more control. I mean, I think this is an amazing racket. You know, if you're looking for a racket, females, a female looking for a racket, kind of light. This is the way to go. Uh, when it comes to the cons, I mean, um, I can't really see any cons on this. I mean, I want a little bit more, I don't think just a little bit more, but I mean, it, it, other than that, you know, it is over, it's three, over $300 racket, you know, so it's a little pricey, but uh, I wouldn't consider that as a con because, you know, premium rackets are going for, you know, for more than $300. On defense, I will give it a 7.5. 
8.0. Uh, offense, about around the same thing. I, I, I need something that, that I feel the weight on that racket. Uh, same thing on the aerial game. I didn't ha I didn't feel that ball coming out of the racket. And who's this racket for? Uh, I will uh, definitely. It's, it's it's a great racket for beginners. Uh, definitely uh, low intermediate, and I would say um, a female high intermediate will be a great racket for that. Uh, somebody who is not that strong. Uh, I wouldn't say it's a great racket for. Um, male high intermediate or advanced definitely is not so don't even go there but it's great for beginners even juniors will be a great racket yeah, yeah. yeah and and low intermediates so i'm thinking as a female so not not for me okay and we we use uh, female rackets and we review them as well uh, again I, I i wouldn't use this racket but uh, I would rate this thinking as, as a female. I'm going to rate this probably as a nine in wow. the defense. The ball came out really easy. And another nine in, in the, when it comes to offense. I think this is a great racket for women and for some juniors as well. Yeah. Remember this Bea Gonzalez's racket? I think that this is for, I think, an intermediate to an advanced player. Women's, okay? Uh, meet uh, intermediate to advanced player, for sure. Um, so, I overall, a nine, a general oh, nine. Uh, let me ask one thing. Where can they get it? Oh, boy. PaddleSmashAcademy.com. That's where you can get it. We review all our rackets there, and we only sell the rackets that we review. This this racket is going for $330. Uh, it's just new. She just developed it. She just got put on bull paddle. Uh, I think they did an amazing job. I think, again, this is going to be in the top five of my best female rackets. And, and let me tell you something interesting. I mean... We don't review any rackets. We only review the rackets that we find them could be a great racket for us first as players and for you also as player. And this is a great racket uh, for you. And all the rackets that we do, we're trying to bring the racket to you that will take your paddle game to the next level. All right, Julian, what's a like new racket? I mean, I see that all the time on our site. Are you kidding me? I mean, it, those are the rackets that we review on our channel and Max, we use it no more than seven minutes. That's and right. That's right. That's right. So we take that racket, we review it. We probably play with it, what, a minute or two? Yeah. Right? And same with thing with you for that day. And afterwards, that's it. We put it into our shop and you could take advantage of this and get anywhere from 20 to 40% off. Exactly. We are all things paddle.